Hi guys, so we are going to be taking a look at the first two days of your poetry calendar for this week. Last week you guys practiced analyzing a lot and did a nice job with kind of going deeper into poetry. This week we're going to be focusing on writing your own poetry, okay? So if you look at our calendar, our first objective for both Monday and Tuesday is I can write my own free verse poem. So really our goal right now is to figure out what is a free verse poem and then how can I write my own. So your directions are, number one, make sure you're watching um, the lesson, which hopefully you're doing, right? If you can see me, you're doing that. We're going to look at some examples, and then you're going to complete today's activity, which is writing your own free verse poem, and this will be both for Monday and Tuesday of this week, okay? So the first thing is we're going to look at some examples of free verse poetry. So really what this means um, is with free verse, that means that it doesn't follow a specific structure or rules. We learned a lot of those structures last week, like rhyme scheme, um, uh, you know, using different pieces of figurative language, stanzas. For free verse poetry, there's really no um, set rules that it follows. It just kind of goes through and presents the idea using whatever it needs to. All right, so there's two examples. Um, this first one is called Monsters. I highly recommend you watch this one on your own. It has a really cool animation with it. The second one I want to go over with you is called Those Winter Sundays. And you can also, excuse me, you can also listen to it here um, when we're done if you need to. Okay, so here's our poem. Sundays too, my father got up early and put his clothes on in the blue-black cold. Then with cracked hands that ached from labor in the weekday weather, made banked fires blaze. No one ever thanked him. I'd wake and hear the cold splintering breaking. When the rooms were warm, he'd call, and slowly I would rise and dress, fearing the chronic angers of that house, speaking indifferently to him, who had driven out the cold and polished my good shoes as well. What did I know, what did I know, of love's asture and lonely offices? So really a lovely poem. This is just about their daily routine, right? And especially on Sundays, um, even though it's not a day of work, the father of the family still gets up, um, you know, warms up the house for everybody, makes sure that they have what they need, gets them ready to go for the day without anybody asking or anybody thanking him. Really nice poem. So here you can see, guys, it doesn't really rhyme. It doesn't follow a specific structure. That's what we call free verse. So the idea is um, still presenting some sort of theme or message just on your own, though, um, kind of using whatever forms you want. OK, so if we go back to our calendar, we can see our activity for today. It's going to ask you to make a copy. Please share this with me right now when you're doing this. OK, so make sure you go up here. So that blue button, oh, my face is in the way. Okay, hit that blue button and please share it with me, all right? So here's how you are going to write your own free verse poem, okay? So now that you have watched the screen set cast and seen some examples, it's your turn. Please follow the steps below. So here's the example, okay? So you're going to first fill out some questions and then you're, um, or see some questions, you're going to type your answers here. So first, mine is about ice cream because it asked me what's my topic. Then I'm going to follow these directions. Describe my topic in one line. Ice cream is cold like a day in winter. What does your topic sound like? It's kind of a weird question, but when I think about ice cream, I think about it sounds like little kids laughing on the playground. I think about joy. I think about all the different things you can hear. Maybe you hear the ice cream truck, right? What does your topic taste like? Well, that's easy, right? It tastes like heaven. It's so cold and so sweet. But what does my topic feel like? To me, it feels like summer. That's a time that I like to enjoy ice cream a lot when it's hot outside. And then one more, describe your topic in a different way. Ice cream is as is a smooth and delicious treat. So that's my whole poem there, right? That's going to be my free verse poem all about ice cream. You will do the same thing down here. Um, so it's going to ask you what's your topic, and then you're going to answer these questions over here to make your poem. All right, and we'll do that two times in a row, once on Monday, once on Tuesday. As you're working at any time, if you have questions, email me immediately, and we can get you on video chat and help you out. Okay, thank you.